isn't your average scoop. It was created nine years ago in Los Angeles by an architect. She stacked ice cream and cookies and made them look like cool houses. Now the business has exploded into a multi-million dollar enterprise with two storefronts, nearly a dozen food trucks nationwide, and it's being sold in more than 6,000 stores. That's right. Here to tell us more, please welcome co-founder of Cool House, Natasha Kay. Hi, Natasha. Hey. Of course, the, the, the biggest question is, how did you go from architect to ice cream mogul? That isn't totally normal journey for you. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> My light bulb moment came during a, stu a studio when a professor of mine criticized a scale model I had made, saying that it looked like a layer cake, um, as though that was a bad thing. Right. So I went ahead and baked the next iteration of the model as a cake. And I had more fun making that cake model. So that was my only all-nighter, I think, in all of undergrad um, than any of the other stuff I had worked on. Uh, so I thought, that's it. I can use food to talk about design concepts and make it more fun. Absolutely. Tell us about that first food truck. I was about 25 years old. And um, I met the other co-founder. We thought the one way we could really you know, enter the marketplace with a splash was with a food truck and uh, be really the first kind of gourmet ice cream truck to hit the streets of Los Angeles. We actually Googled hipster ice cream truck when we thought about launching that and like really nothing came up. So we thought, <laughs> there's an opportunity here. Tell us about some of your sandwiches. Uh, the sandwiches, they are everything from kind of the more classics. We have our chocolate chip Tahitian vanilla bean known as the Mies Vanilla Row. And we have new flavors like uh, one called That Dough Though, which is an amazing cookie dough sandwich, <laughs> a birthday cake sandwich, a double s'mores. So they're just phenomenal. Both the cookie and the ice cream, really good. And uh, we actually have a, a non-dairy line, a vegan line of those coming out next year too. Now, you sent us some samples to try. Thank you, love. Oh yeah, these are substantial right. sandwiches. These are not okay. like, thank you. <laughs> what do we have here? I think you have birthday cake. Uh, on on uh, this one looks yes, like birthday on your cake. Right. Yeah. Yes. That's this one's birthday, birthday cake. cake. Sounds delicious. So that's like a cupcake frosting ice cream and rainbow sprinkle cookie. And then that one's either chocolate chip vanilla, double scores, or cookie dough. You're gonna have to Take be the ultimate taste thing. tester. I'll try it and find out. It's delicious. Chocolate chip or cookie dough? I don't care. It's really good. <laughs> that I love is amazing. A mouthful of ice cream sandwich. So how is business going right now? Oh my gosh. My oh, birthday's oh, oh, oh. in June, but it feels like it's today. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, that's amazing. I oh, really appreciate it. But um, so business is great. Uh, you know, as you can see, when you have a great product and a fun story and an exciting brand with a lot of innovation, uh, we have about 24 products in about 5,000 grocery stores. And then we also have, you know, uh, trucks in three cities uh, in LA, Dallas, and New York and scoop shops in LA and Dallas. Um, and so we have like a trifecta on the marketplace and then just an amazing following of the brand. So we're oh, very, very lucky. We've been wonderful amazing team. story. <laughs> ben just took my birthday cake. All right, it's thank special. you so much, uh, Natasha. You know? Great job. Thank you for having me Amazing. On. Congratulations on everything. Yeah. This is so wonderful. Well deserved. Keep buying women owned. Keep buying Cool House. Yes, ma'am. <laughs>